the boat house. Where are you? In here, B. Uh, where? Over here. I can't see you. Here. made such a scene. She said I, I had a promise never to see you again. That, that you weren't interested in me at all. All you wanted was money. And that if she paid you, you'd never see me again. That's not true, is it? As a matter of fact, B, I am desperate for money. No. What a horrible thing to say. Now, look, if your mother does give me the no. money, that doesn't no. mean let, that I won't see go. you again. Let go. B, it doesn't mean I won't. B, you don't understand. B. Where were you? What's the matter? What happened? You know, Baby. I don't know. Down. 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 Who was it? It was Jan. I, I, mother, you were right. I know, I know. I never should have gone. All right, all right. right. Just try to tell me what happened. I, I was in the boat house. I, I, I only did what well was the money. I, I hate him. Oh, my dear. Where is he now? I, I don't know. I love him. You go on upstairs. I'll be up in a minute. Mrs. Harper? No. Uh, no, thanks. Now he's gone. Oh, Mother, I wish I'd never gone. I wish don't I'd talk about gone. it anymore, dear. It's over. Come on to bed. Come on, dear. It was so awful. I just could never go through with it like that again. I, you won't I have to, don't... dear. I promise you. I'll get you a hot water bottle. We'll help you to sleep. What's all the running up and down stairs, Lucia? Nothing, Father. B isn't feeling well. I'm a growing boy. I need my rest. Go back to bed, David. I said go back to bed. Mother, can I have a piece of chocolate cake? Good night, David. Good morning, Mrs. Harper. Good morning, Sybil. You're up awful early this morning. I couldn't sleep. Can I fix you some breakfast? No, thanks, Sybil. You go back to bed. I'm going for a walk. Yes, sir.
Mother! Mother! You shouldn't have gone out in the boat. Why not? I haven't put in the new spark plugs yet, which incidentally I bought with my own money and you owe me 50 cents for. I'll pay you back. Load on your pants and button your jacket, David. You might have got stuck out there. Well, I didn't, so don't worry about it. I think I'll put those plugs in right now. What are you doing out of the pack of dawn? Father, I... I, I talked to you, Mr. Harker. Sybil, you know I drink tea. Really, Lucy, you were taking an awful chance in that boat. I think David's been fooling around with that outboard motor. Probably got most of it in his car. What anyone wants to get up at dawn for? Uh, this is Harper. Yeah? Uh, I want to add something to that shopping list we made last night. Mm. I have it right here. Well, I had it. I know. You put it in your pocket so you wouldn't forget it like the last time. I know. Mother, was the anchor in the boat this morning? I don't know. Somebody swiped it. Who'd steal an anchor? I don't know, but it was in the boat yesterday. If Mother didn't see it this Never morning... Never mind, David. We'll get a new one. B. Yes, Mother. Good morning. B, I want to talk to you a minute. David and Grandpa, they no, don't know about dear, it. that's what I want to talk to you about. B, did you ever tell anyone you were going with Ted Darby? No. Good. If I ever could have been fooled by that... Oh, stop it, B. I know how you feel, but you mustn't talk against him or about him to anyone. You mustn't even mention his name. Do you understand? Oh, I'd rather die than have anyone know I ever knew him. B, is there anything about last night that you haven't told me? No. No, there's nothing. You're sure? Yes. Go down to breakfast, dear. You're late. Well, well, are you coming? I'll be right down. Well, you should. You know, we must make a point of seeing a lot of each other during the holidays. Please, fellow. What? We'll try. Oh, and he'll be home from school tomorrow, and I know he'll be dying to see Beatrice. Yes. We'll do that, Cat. We can't ship it like this. Beatrice is always like, though. Oh, well, Owen is always like. Well, what's the matter with it? I did the best I could. You might have done the best you could, Mrs. Fellow, but the best is none too good. All I want from this post office is delivery, not philosophy. Take a look, a little excitement. Lucia, doesn't it look all right to you? Well, I think he'd know, Catherine. Find some cord on that table by the window. What happened? Ex-art dealer murdered in bed.